So what are some of your biggest concerns about the future of enterprise? I wonder how the IT organization is going to be, what it's going to look like in the future. Um, because with the mode to outsourcing or software as a service, virtualization of servers, those kind of things, I'm just wondering what my staff and my organization is going to look like in two, three years down the road. Mm -hmm. Just to uh, what kind of training they're going to need, what kind of uh, value they're going to provide to the college, and those kind of things. So I'm looking towards uh, what's going to happen to them and how are we going to fit in. I do think our skill sets will change. I think we'll have less technical people and more people with the softer skills, the negotiation skills, the uh, collaborator skills. My biggest concern for, for the future of enterprise is that we don't get bogged down in status quo the way we've always we've always done things this way kind of thinking. We need to start to step away from the, the traditional enterprise model, probably try and flip it upside down. Mm -hmm. Well, my biggest concern really is about how to have the right conversation with uh, my chancellor, my provost, and uh, my deans, is uh, we provide services to them, and I don't think we've found the right level of conversation about um, many of the areas within uh, within IT. I think it is important that is going to be framed about teaching and learning and, and the future. And I think it's really important to get individuals for whom that is their daily uh, life more engaged in the conversation. And, and our chancellors, our provosts, our deans, they're all very uh, uh, interested in where are things headed with regard to academic computing. And in that sense, I define that as interested in aspects of that that are more enterprise. My biggest concern really I think relates more to the people and our ability to make decisions on the pace that we need to make that uh, make them happen. So uh, we need to be much more agile, we need to make decisions with limited information, and we need to make sure that our decisions are transparent as are the criteria by which we make them. Uh, I'm really a big proponent of better portfolio management so that our senior leadership can be engaged in the big questions of our day too. My concerns really are stemming more from the fact that are we able to work with the end user community? Are we able to um, demonstrate the value that IT provides to them? Because as uh, with the commodity market going strong with everybody using tools like iPads and iPhones, the end users start thinking about those tools as a technology and they, they don't necessarily remember that there's an underlying infrastructure that has to be thought through and there's still a great need for and demand for um, and always will be for, for a great underlying architectural skill set.